Good afternoon. Here are your equity news highlights of the day. Power cuts weigh on Bindura output as production came off 10% in their third quarter to 31 December 2019. However, revenue and profits mounted 15% and 76% respectively as nickel prices continue to strengthen. Nickel prices have surged 34% since the third quarter of 2018. London listed miner Caledonia reports a 162% growth in EBITDA to 10 million US dollars in the first quarter of 2020. This comes on the back of improved operational efficiencies as well as strengthening prices of gold. Gold output increased by a significant 19% to 14,000 ounces of gold. Listed financial services group NMB reports a 557% growth in their total income to a figure of 145 million Zimbabwean dollars in the first quarter of 2020. The group has a liquidity ratio of 56%, bolstering their solvency in the face of uncertainties presented by COVID-19. Zimbabwe and Zambian operations weigh on pick and pay as their profits took a 37% knock in the year ended 3 March 2020. The results reflect the overhanging effects of inflation as well as currency changes as the firm shared $174 million in losses on impairment of their Zimbabwean investments through TM Pick and Pay. The International Monetary Fund has approved a $2.8 billion US dollar bailout package for Egypt. The fund is meant to mitigate the economic effects of the pandemic on the Egyptian economy. Ibn Mabunda from Harare, this is Equity Access.